Hi, I'm Jillian and welcome to my channel. I've decided to do a closet declutter. I am a former shopaholic and I am currently doing a no buy year to get over my bad shopping habits. And while I'm fairly minimal when it comes to the rest of my belongings and our house, my closet is the one area that I struggle with. I still think I own a little too much clothing. By continuing to hold on to this clothing, I feel like I'm not being true to myself. That's a little deep. My ultimate goal has always been to have two separate capsule wardrobes, one for the cold weather months and one for the warm weather months. And I just made my first attempt at doing a cold weather capsule. So that is actually in my closet. I'm not going to take it out because I plan on keeping all of those items. I have already brought everything that I own to the bed. My plan is to separate everything on the bed into categories and then I'm going to go through each category and decide whether I'm going to keep it, consign, or donate it. Now that I've said all of that, let's get into this mess. I'm going to be listening to The House of Sky and Breath by Sarah Moss while I do this. <laughs> two categories. Those are vests. This is jackets and coats. Here we have skirts and shorts, some knits, pants, shoes, dresses, like tops, tank tops, and then we have shirts and blouses. And a jazzy. Hi, jazzy. And those are my blazers. As I'm going through each of the categories, I'm basically going to be as brutal as I can be with these items. I'm going to stop holding on to them just because I think they're really pretty. I want to be realistic about how many times I'm actually going to wear them and get rid of the ones that I know I'm not going to wear very often. My ultimate goal is to have a smaller wardrobe full of items that I wear constantly. I am going to have a separate like dressy capsule for those items that I really love but only wear for special occasions. when it comes to my items that I've sewn myself. May not be into wearing these pants right now in this very moment, but I feel like I could be at another point. They're green, they're wide leg, they have an elastic waist. 
um, and I made them. So I think I have an attachment to the items that I've made and I have a harder time getting rid of them. So I'm going to hold on to these for now. These two pants are vintage wool pants. I need to shorten them a little bit. coach bag that I think I bought around 13 years ago. She's so beautiful and I do use her. She stays. This is a vintage coach bag that I got at a charity event. They were doing a silent auction and I do love it. I think it's so beautiful but I don't wear it and I don't really use it big handbags. So I think I'm going to send this back to the charity so they can use it in the future. getting it framed, like making uh, making a plexiglass box for it. Look at this beading. Somebody did that probably by hand. My gray wool blazer. This one is absolutely staying. I recently got these bins. So I'm going to pull those down and put my summer capsule in there my other winter items and the maybe items, I think.
day. Uh, I had to finish filming yesterday because my camera battery went dead and I only have one. But I did continue to declutter a little bit more and I found a couple of accessories. This little linen collar and a beret. And then I have a pair of boots. And then I also found a few more things to get rid of. So this is a blazer that I love. It's silk, it's a beautiful print. I've kind of been holding onto it because I like this fabric so much. So what I have decided to do is turn it into one of my favorite tops, the Camille Top by Makayla Creates. I am going to move this item over to my alterations pile. I also decided to do something similar with this checkered blazer down here. So let me set you down. So I just wanted to go through the things that I'm going to get rid of in this round. So I'm gonna get rid of a blazer, a dress, two dresses, but these are gonna go down in a summer bag. A checked coat. I actually just bought this. I've only ever worn it for a styling uh, reel and I just don't see me reaching for this over other things that I own. So I'm going to get rid of it. This is a checkered blazer that I'm going to keep. It's wool but it's a suiting wool. I'm going to make a top out of it with like maybe a little peplum ruffle on the bottom. I have a dress pattern that I'm going to go by for the top portion. But this is going to go into my alteration pile as well. This is what I'm getting rid of. is going to be used to make the bustier top. This one is going to be used to make another summer top. These two pairs of pants have to be hemmed. This I'm going to use to make a summer skirt. And these I need to make the waist smaller. Here is my closet. All of my clothes are currently in this Ikea Pax wardrobe that I just got and we put together this past weekend. So on the bottom, I have my fall winter shoes and boots. Here I have two more pairs of boots in the back, a pair of loafers and a pair of dressier, shoe, dressier boots. Then I have four sweaters that are in my capsule and three more here. Here I have two of my most worn bags and another pair of boots up there. There's a pair of loafers in a box back behind that I'm going to reevaluate next year. Most of the items in here are part of my dressier capsule wardrobe. I have a vintage silk jacket leather jacket, silk blazer, wool dress, silk, silk dress that I made, a few more dresses, a skirt, some tops and vests, and then these four items are part of my capsule wardrobe. And then over here, from the green jacket over is my capsule wardrobe. And then this is my wool blazer, purple suede jacket that I'm excited for in the spring and then this is another wool bomber style jacket. This box up here holds all of my spring and summer items. There is 26 clothing items and then one leather bag and two canvas bags. 
This has 13 extra winter items that I'll pull out when it gets colder. And this over here has three jackets, or I'm sorry, three coats that I will also pull down when it gets colder. And then I have belts. And then this drawer holds my underwear, socks, and pajamas. This one holds my other capsule wardrobe items. So it is two pairs of jeans and then three pairs of pants. And then down here is where I keep um, just my athleisure. And this is my workout wear. And then those two sweaters are part of my capsule wardrobe as well.